Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen. I am Rick Godley. Happens to be Saturday, and this big blue building with the beautiful mural on it is the home of the Ruston Farmers Market. Godley works for nonprofits. This time, it's the Ruston Farmers Market. We're going to be doing some special attention, also going inside to see who wants to tell their story of who they are, what they do, why they do what they do, and then we're going to post it up. And this is why you bookmark. ATL-Ruston.com, www.atl-Ruston.com, also ATL-Lincoln.com. Why? ATL stands for all things local, so we're going to be local nonprofits, going to be local businesses, local events, local music, makers, music museums, government issues. Uh, we're out here with the feet on the street covering for you so if you can dream it I can stream it and that is what we're going to do going into 2022 Ruston Farmers Market the uh, mural by the way behind me oh I need to get a um, I'm looking at the rendition Mike Eccles is gonna do for what's behind here at the farmers market but this is the mural painters of 2016 it is Nick Bustamante and Whitney Tristler Causey uh, did this beautiful piece of art and also they've done some others throughout the town of Ruston. So we're gonna come across the street, get the camera, walk in, look left, look right, look left, look right again. Walk into the Ruston Farmers Market, see who's up for it today. And uh, let's see, oh yes, the uh, Holiday Arts Market's going on at the Norton Art Building, but that'll be for you to take advantage of next year. So ATL, all things local. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome in. I am Rick Godley, atl-ruston.com, atl-lincoln.com. This is Food for Talk from the Ruston Farmers Market, rustonfarmersmarket.org. Last week, walked down aisle one, got to meet and greet and know your local grower. Well, today, it is John Stack IV, and this happens to be Fuego Dolce, Sweet Fire Sauces of Dubok. John, how you doing? I'm doing great, man. How are you doing? I am doing well as well. Here we are a couple of weeks before Christmas, but consistency with what your product is all year long. Tell folks uh, what you make. I make hot sauces, sauces, dips, marineras, taco sauces, spicy brownies, pretty much anything you can and cannot think of at all. And it's been going on for seven years now. You are one of the inspirations, actually several of the inspirations, behind some of my milder sauces and dips as well. But if you said something there, if you cannot imagine it, I can still make it. Now, that is the challenge, but we won't go there right now. Your top seller of the sauces is what? My medium salsa, the one you can get here, Super One, Ruston, Super One, West Monroe, Divine Wine in the Keg Package Store, order online. That tends to be the best seller, not to mention the dips that I make with them, whether it's the queso or the Greek fuego or any of the other ones <laughs> that are made with all of my sauces and sauces and a lot of the products that I get here locally at the farmers market from Estes Farms to Current Farms to Smith Family Farms for the ground beef we all try to help each other because we're all here together sure enough you want to shop online Fuego Dulce Sauces.com Fuego Dulce Sauces dot com and uh, all the products shipped out of Dubak Louisiana yes. Dubai, yeah, Fuego Dulce Sauces and Bottling Company, LLC. Yes, we ship worldwide now. And you're set up at the farmer's market. You mentioned your products are available at Brookshire's in West Monroe. No, Super One on West Cypress in West Monroe. Okay. Super One here in Ruston, Louisiana. Divine Wine in the Keg Package Store. Not just the sauces and salsa, but all the dips are there as well, along with all your lovely libations. All right, FuegoDulceSauces.com. And remember to bookmark www.atl-ruston.com. That's all things local. Also, www.atl-lincoln.com. If you could dream it, I can stream it. Hashtag Everlocalb. I'm Rick Godley, John Stack. We'll stream you later. Thank you.